as diverse as its inhabitants. A city famous for earthquakes in a state famous for earthquakes. And a fading memory for many San Franciscans. October 17, 1989, 5.04 in the afternoon. The third game of the World Series had not yet started, but players had started to warm up, and coverage of the game had already begun when the earthquake struck. <laughs> Yeah. The ground shook for 15 seconds. We can't replicate the full force of the quake, its upward and downward motions, but this simulation gives you a sense of what people experienced. 63 people were killed, nearly 4,000 injured, and thousands more left homeless. But the city's most famous earthquake packed a much bigger punch. We can roll back time to imagine the San Francisco of more than a hundred years ago. April 18, 1906, 512 in the morning. The city awakens and comes to life. The busiest port city in America has grown up rapidly with hastily built areas and poor infrastructure. The entire event lasted more than 90 seconds, three times longer than you're experiencing here. If the damage from the earthquake itself weren't enough, fires started in the wake of the event caused more than 500 city blocks to burn to the ground. More than 3,000 people died in the 1906 earthquake and fire. We don't know when the next earthquake will take place, but we can all make choices to help ensure our safety during such an event. Look around you. What has shifted and moved in the course of recreating the two earthquakes? The books on the shelves, the dishes in the cupboard, the pictures on the wall, all could rattle loose during a template. Head toward the next part of our exhibit to learn what you can do to prepare for an earthquake.